Okay, today I'm going to uh, you, show you a few more things in Dammit, basically to uh, get you really up to speed and comfortable with uh, using it on a day-to-day -day basis. So the first thing that you're probably going to want to do is add some actual tasks which are more relevant to the type of stuff that you do in your life and work, or probably mostly just work. So if we go, actually no, let's not do that, let's do it this way. There we go. So you can see there's a whole heap of um, there's a whole heap of different tasks here. So let's uh, say we want to go and add one because at the moment I'm recording all these episodes for the YouTube channel. So let's go and add something for that. So if we go done it minus help equals and we'll say add task. Okay. So here it is telling us how to do it. So we just want to go done it add task equals and we're going to say rec for recording um, who we're just going to leave blank um, it's uh, we could put in say I could put in me or uh, we could say this task is usually for so and so and so then when um, well, actually no let's put that in uh, if you leave it blank it'll just default to no one um, if you put in someone it will default to that person um, yeah, anyway, uh, so a description, um, recording videos, uh, recording a video for funnyhacks.com, okay, uh, context, and we'll make that uh, project, um, so for all of these ones so far, you'll see context is this thing in blue, and it's very hard to see with this color scheme, but you can see here is uh, work, and here is personal, and those are the only two contexts that I've used so far. However, I'm doing this long-term project at the moment, so it makes sense to actually put this towards project. Um, and update or silent, I don't need to put either of those on there. Um, that there is useful so let's say, okay, let's say we're happy with this, boink, okay, and we go back and we list tasks, and so now we've got uh, rec in here, and let's say actually me was not, um, uh, me was not useful in there, so we could say, we'll update, and then we'll say actually we want to put in Kevin. Okay, and now if we go and list tasks, and you can see now we've got Kevin in there. So now if we go today and have a look at what we're doing, um, now we might want to say, uh, well, hey, now that we've got this new code, why don't we actually, um, why don't we fix this existing entry to be using that? So we'll say we want the last entry. There it is. And we'll go amend equals rec. And so now if we go and have a look at today, you'll see now we've got this fancy code uh, being used for the last entry. Uh, so actually we should put in here, we'll just put in boink boink amend is the thing that I used there. So I've uh, shown you resume the other day. Um, let's just quickly, um, let's go and resume this task here. So. Um, we're going to go done it today and we're going to refine equals guts. Okay, we've got that one and we want to resume that. And so now if we go back to today, you can see we've resumed that. And then we go, well actually, hang on. Um, no, we've, we've finished doing that. Now we want to go back to recording. And so we can just say done it, resume, and it'll automatically take the one that was just uh, the previous one. So if we go back to, to today, and you can see right now we're, we're back onto recording. But then you might say, well, hang on. Um, no, that, that was a mistake. We, we do actually need to continue working on guts. So let's go and remove last did. And that's, that'll remove the last thing that we did. Um, but there is a little quirk with this. It's not entirely uh, clean at the moment. So if we go and have a look at today, you'll see it doesn't show in progress 
um, on the sentry at the moment. It still shows that um, it's only lasted for 14 seconds. It is going to stay that way until we go and do something. So now we could say um, done it doing equals email and if we have a look now you're going to see that okay it was actually tracking the time all of that time it's just that um, the end timestamp was still sitting as it was before but now it has actually been updated to uh, when the email started hopefully that makes sense okay we have some entries we can search for now so you notice here that we've got MISC showing up a couple of times. Let's find out how much time we've spent doing MISC. So we go refine equals MISC, and you can see that we've spent a total of 4.2 minutes doing MISC. Um, let's find out how much time we've spent doing RAC. There we go, we've spent 4.8 minutes doing that. Um, we could say, have I got a BP? So let's find out um, uh, how much time I've spent doing personal stuff. And there we go, I spent uh, uh, 1.5 minutes there. And if I go work, I haven't done any work uh, today, have I? Oh, yes I have. Um, so yeah, these, these items here are things that I've done, uh, uh, these I've got labelled as work. So potentially those would need to be uh, updated for my current context, but um, uh, yeah. All of the, so you, there is a video where I've shown lots of things like um, doing first, last, um, offset results and all sorts of stuff like that. Um, exclude, um, so yeah, um, I've got a video which details all of that already. So. Um, uh, yeah, go and, go and look at that for how you can do all the advanced stuff there. I think this will cover this video quite nicely. If you have any questions or things you'd like to know, problems, whatever, uh, put them in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer them. Um, if I've missed your comment, uh, other people are welcome to jump in and I'll uh, help out wherever I can. Um, yeah, sometimes I just simply don't see the comments, but uh, yeah. Uh, ask away and I'll do my best to answer. See ya.